Who's brought it? It was the bye week anyhow. What are we supposed to do? Watch the Denver Broncos? Jeez. Well, at least he's better than he was last year. Don't you remember? Oh. I found him curled up on the floor in the fetal position, just clutching his Rams jersey and repeating, we've got a hell of a team, over and over. Ellen, are you sure today is October 6th? Maybe the Times made a mistake. Wait a minute. Maybe the Rams can play a game today after all. Oh, Merlin. Want to play some football? <sighs> oh. He's at it again. I, I gotta go. But I don't want to be the 49ers again. You always make me be the 49ers. I want to be the Rams this time. Merlin, how many times do I have to tell you I get to be the Rams? Now, when you grow up and you're playing against your own son, you can be the Rams, but until then, you're the 49ers. Now, kick off. What a jerk. Ed, honey, telephone. Can't you see I'm playing? Pretty good gig, huh, Dad? Ed, honey, are you all right? Call Dr. Curlin. Dr. Curlin? Who is Dr. Curlin? Dr. Curlin, Dr. Robert Curlin, the Rams doctor. Geez, don't you know anything? Well, forgive me. What am I going to tell John Robinson? John Robinson. Very funny. Ed, he is on the phone. That's what I've been trying to tell you. John Robinson? On the phone now? For me? What, 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 what does he want? Why don't you ask him? H hiya, Coach. Uh, Mr. Robinson, sir. Uh, uh, what, what's up? Listen, Ed. I've got a problem here, and I need your help. My help? The league's invoked the new Zendejas rule. The Zendejas rule? It's a new rule. There can't be more than five Zendejas is kicking at any one time, and we've exceeded the limit, so I need a new kicker. My scouts have been keeping an eye on you, and I want to sign you right now. But I've got to have you for this weekend. I'll pay you $2 million, but you've got to be ready Sunday. What do you say? Do I have a new kicker? I, I, I... All right, all right, we'll make it three million. But that's as high as I can go. We're still the Rams, you know. What do you say, do we have a deal? Yes, sir! Great. See you at Anaheim Stadium on Sunday. What was that all about, honey? John Robinson wants me to play for the Rams. What? Me, Ed Eagle, starting place kicker for the Rams! My dream has come true! <laughs> Rams today announced the signing of a Van Nuys used car salesman to replace kicker Tony Zendejas. Ed Eagle, whose only football experience has been beating the stuffing out of his son in games of touch football, said in the understatement of the century that he was, quote, shocked when he received the call. Fellas, how about that Ed Eagle? Did you hear he replaced Zendejas as kicker for the Rams? Who the heck is Ed Eagle? <laughs> place kicker for the Los Angeles Rams. An unlikely story it is. He joins us now up close. Next on Geraldo, you all know the story of Ed Eagle, the car salesman turned pro football kicker. But do you know the real facts and circumstances surrounding his sordid sex life? Find out on the next Geraldo. Hi, do you know me? Last week I was a used car salesman, but this week I am the starting place kicker for the Los Angeles Rams. Stadium. I'm Paul Olden with Jack Youngblood, welcoming you to what should be an exciting afternoon of football. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah. The stage is set for what could be the first in NFL history. Earlier this week, John Robinson was forced to sign Ed Eagle, an untested, inexperienced, and very nervous used car salesman, to take over the kicking duties. But here it is game time, and we've not seen any sign of Eagle on the playing field. <laughs> Coach Robinson appears very anxious, probably wondering where his new kicker is. Wait a minute, there seems to be a commotion at the Rams tunnel. Yes, it looks like an eagle has finally arrived, much to the delight of the fans. And 
and trots onto the field. We're just about set now for the opening kickoff. Whew. It's a beautiful kickoff sailing out of the end zone. Well, Jack Youngblood, I guess you could say the eagle has landed. Fourth down at the Rams' own 25-yard line, down two to nothing on a safety, folks. With only one second left in the game, it's come down to this. Much too far for a Hail Mary pass. So what can the Rams do? Wait a minute. John Robinson is calling in Ed Eagle, who has never even attempted an extra point, let alone a field goal. What can he be thinking? Well, obviously, he has a lot of confidence in his new kicker, to say the least. All right, this will be a record 92-yard attempt. You heard me right, 92 yards. Lines are set. There's the snap, the spot, the ball down, the kick on the way. What a kick. It could be. It might be. Yes, it's long enough. It's good. A 92-yard field goal. The Rams win on the most incredible kick ever in the history of the game. I don't believe it. I do not believe it. I don't believe it. I'm going to Disneyland. I'm going to Disneyland. Pretty good kick, huh, Dad? Ed, honey, are you all right? The field goal was good. I'm going to Disneyland. Ed, wake up. What are you talking about? He called me. It was so real. He called me. Who called you? John Robinson. He called me. I know, Ed. He's on the phone. John Robinson's on the phone. See, it wasn't a dream. Hey, coach, you need another 92-yard field goal? What do you say we go for the full 100 yards this time? Ed, it's not that John Robinson. It's the other John Robinson. What other John Robinson? Our insurance agent. Remember, you signed with him because of his name. That John Robinson? Pfft. Well, what does he want? Well, he wants you to sign a new policy with him. He wants me to sign with him? Hey, John, did I ever tell you about my football career? You know, I was a puny little kid.